Once you set up invoice payments for Sage50 accounts, if you don't want to use the standard invoice payments layouts, you can add a pay now button to your own invoice layout. This allows your customers to quickly pay you online by card payment using Stripe or via PayPal. We're now going to demonstrate how easy it is to add a pay now button to your own invoice layout. To start with, we go into invoices and credits, select an invoice that you've already entered, and then click print. We're now going to edit one of the default layouts that includes the pay now button. So we click the layouts folder and then scroll to the bottom of the standard list of layouts and we need to select the layout called email invoice euro with Sage invoice payments or Sage pay. Once selected you then click edit and this opens the layout in the Sage report designer. You then scroll to the bottom of the invoice layout and you can then see the pay now button. So we select it and then from the edit menu you choose copy. You then need to minimize your Sage report designer window. Now make sure you don't close it at this point, you must minimize it. It's then a case of selecting your own layout, so in our example it's flagged as one of our favorites. It's already selected and then we can just click edit. It's now just a case of scrolling down to the bottom of the invoice layout and choosing a location for the pay now button. If there's already space we can just right click and choose paste. We can then use the mouse to drag the button into position or alternatively just use a cursor keys on the keyboard. Once in the right position, just click off the button and then open the file menu, choose save and that's it done. You can now just close the two layouts and to do this you open the file menu, choose close all and then open the file menu again and choose exit. And that's the process complete. We've now added the pay now button to our layout. Just to confirm this, we'll just quickly preview an invoice Again, we'll scroll to the bottom and there it is. If the pay now button isn't quite in the right position, you can always just edit your layout again and either use your mouse or use your cursor keys to move the button into position.